What's happening, everybody? It's Rod with Power Group. Welcome back on The Pursuit of Wall. Today is Monday, November 8th. And in this short video today, really excited, going to be going over Trust Beverage Co. sending me some free samples. So we'll get into that here in just a second. But before we jump in, make sure to smash like, subscribe to the channel, click the little bell to be notified on any future updates and stick around and we'll jump into it here in just a second. All right, welcome back to the show, everybody. So just before we jump into the product sampling, the review and the unboxing real quick, for anybody that doesn't know who Trust Beverage Co. is, Trust is a joint venture between Molson Coors Canada and Hexacorp, which was formed back on August 1st, 2018. And that was going to be how the two were going to tackle the beverage category in Canada with the recreational market. And they've since taken number one market share by a country mile, as Trent would say. It's been a phenomenal ride. I've been sampling and trying all the products from day one. I knew about them before they even came out. And it's just awesome to be able to do these product reviews videos. I really enjoy doing it and uh, really excited about the one here today. So there was some news that came out that there was a new brand in the trust portfolio. It was as a result of a partnership with Two Roots Beverage Co. out of San Diego, and they were both going to pair up again as well to tackle the Canadian market. Two Roots Beverage Co. pairing the best liquids from North America with the best in cannabis. Two Roots Beverage Co. announced its partnership to provide non-alcoholic beer for Trust Beverage Co., newly launched brand Bedfellows Liquid Arts. And that was the product sample that I was sent from Trust Beverage Co. and a third party company that they're working with, which we'll get into here in just a second. But the partnership brings Canadian consumers of legal age carefully crafted cannabis beverages and takes a uniquely collaborative approach to drive innovation, combining the best products across North America. Now more than ever, consumers are looking for an alternative adult beverage options to socialize and relax, said Michael Van de Mortel, Chief Marketing and Revenue Officer of Two Roots Beverage Co. Like Trust, we are dedicated in our pursuit to deliver a premium beverage experience which has resulted in the winning of many prestigious national and international awards for our portfolio of brands. We're excited to be part of Trust's journey to bring their first collaborative cannabis beverages to Canada. Two Roots Beverage Co. is known for setting the quality standard and retaining mouthfeel, aroma, taste profiles for its non-alcoholic and malt beverages. Because of the dedication to delivering a premium beverage experience, Two Roots Beverage Co. was selected to collaborate on a new Bedfellows products being produced in the Canadian market, Trust Beverage Co., Haas Mates and Indie Pals. And I did do a prior video. I did a review video on those, the actual ones with, with cannabis in them. You can check out that video, but the drinks work really well. One had 10, 10 milligrams of THC, one had 7.5 milligrams. So you drink a couple of those and you definitely you definitely feel it. I'm somebody who consumes quite a bit and they, you know, I need to add a little bit of drops as well. So you can get these XMG drops, they're about $30 a bottle. They last me about a month and you can add it in and you can really add, if you're concerned about the potency, you can add any any amount that you want with those drops, right? Personally, I'll drink about four or five of those, add five or six drops per drink and I'm good to go. And like I said, it, it has a quick onset, usually about 10 to 15 minutes. And like I said, you can definitely feel the effects. And if you're somebody like me, who's a little bit more of an avid consumer, then you can you can add those drops in as well. So jumping over to Trust Beverage Co. website, you can see here, this is the new category for the Bedfellows brand. A collection of carefully crafted cannabis beverages for shared adventures journey into the uncharted. So you can see this is the Hossmates. And like I said, I'm not going to go into the details because I did a prior video on that. But if you want to go back to that video, all the information is here if you want to pause and look at it or just check out Trust Beverage, uh, trustbeverages.com. This was the company that reached out to me. They sent me an email. We are social. And I got an email from one of their employees and they said that they were you know, emailing me on behalf of their client, Trust Beverage Co., and they wanted to thank me for my support and sharing my experience on YouTube. So they obviously came across my video on YouTube and they were able to basically invite me into this program where they will send you a Bedfellows Liquid Arts kit. So initially I was wondering how they were going to be able to do that. But then there's a disclaimer saying, please note that the kit samples do not contain cannabis. So uh, and they don't contain alcohol either if the YouTube algo is listening. So if you're interested, they said, just send us your information and uh, basically fill out this form. And if you qualify, you couldn't be from Quebec and there was a bunch of stipulations, right? So there was a policy that, uh, privacy policy, all that good stuff. All right, so here we go. This is what they sent me, Bedfellows Liquid Arts. It says in the front that it's intended for persons of legal age only. It actually doesn't contain any MJ or anything like that or any alcohol. So it's literally just the uh, the craft beer. So this is the We Are Social company that sent it on behalf of Trust Beverage Co. 
which is a joint venture between Hexacorp and Molson Coors. So pretty cool. They saw a video of mine and a product review on YouTube, and uh, they asked me if I wanted to sign up in this program, which is basically they send the big token of their appreciation. They send you this kit, and we're going to open it together here. So pretty cool. Like I said, this was a collaboration between Truss and Two Roots, and that's a brewing company in California. But you can see here, they even sent me a pretty cool uh, XMG pin. So start wondering, XMG Truss, trustbeverages.com, must be legal drinking age. So welcome bedfellow, sit and sip, and you shall depart into the uncharted world of liquid arts. I got a pretty cool card here with some nice branding on it. So welcome to the world of Bedfellows, bringing together creative minds with a passion to develop liquid change. We've carefully crafted these beverages for curious minds and shared adventures, journey into the uncharted and Bedfellows, Indie Pals, and Hossmates. So these samples do not contain cannabis, must be legal age, do not mix with alcohol, trust beverage co. Use under license, sip responsibly. All right, so let's jump into the rest of this box here. So you can see they got a package pretty good. And there is the different design on them. So again, these are different than the actual ones that you would buy in a cannabis store because those are actually branded under Health Canada. They have to have proper labeling, that type of thing. Warnings labels as well. So these are just literally the, the liquid. So they, it just has the craft beer. There's no alcohol or cannabis in these. So pretty cool. So this is the Indie Pals. And it's going to be interesting to see whether or not these actually taste the same as the ones, if you can notice a, a significant difference in the taste profile. And there is the Hossmates. So pretty cool. Just looking at the front here. So Liquid Arts, a creative collaboration. Hossmates, this sample does not contain cannabis. Malt flavored beverage. So you can just flip it over here. So 125 calories. A balance of malt sweetness with floral noble hop character that delivers a clean finish and you can see your ingredients carbonated water malted barley hops calcium chloride and yeast so no alcohol no cannabis sample not for sale imported by trust beverage co belleville ontario the belleville center of excellence which won award for best manufacturing award of the year all right let's get some samples going and i've got my trusty xmg drops here as well but i'm not going to add those right away i'm going to add those after remember there's no cannabis so I'm not going to keep it that way that would be uh that would be tragic so we'll hold off on those for now but we'll start with the Haas mates so again we're going to see whether or not they taste different than the ones with actual mj infused into them so first on the list Haas mates so far it's looking quite similar all right Let's give it a try. Tastes a little flat, not gonna lie. But overall, really, really good. Next, we're gonna do the Indie Pals. So again, this one's more of the IPA style. But thank you very much, Trust Beverage Co. for sending me this. And this is the IPA style one. You can see it's fairly similar as my previous review. Really cloudy. And I'm excited to try this, let's see. All right, yeah, that one tastes pretty much identical in terms of taste profile. So generally I add to them, I add the drops to them. And especially in this case, since there's no THC in it at all. And like I said, they're able to get away with it because they're not actually infusing it with any alcohol or any, any cannabis. And I took the XMG drops on the plane with me, just a heads up that you shouldn't take these on the plane. I don't know if it was the pressure from the plane or if it was in the, uh, I think most of it actually leaked out. So that's a bummer, but I think it could have been somebody put their bag next to mine and uh, and it just, you know, there's too much crammed into one overhead bin, but not sure if it was the pressure or other bags surrounding it just bumping into it that made it burst just because you're squeezing it, right? But uh, pretty much lost most of my bottle. I would say three quarters of the bottle on the plane. So that made quite a bit of mess all over my clothes. That was unfortunate. So just fair warning, if you're gonna travel with one, make sure you have it in some kind of some kind of container. Cheers. Oh man, that Haas Mates is really good. I can't wait for everybody at home to try these. These are fantastic. And uh, Two Roots Brewing Co., one of the best craft brewers in all of America, so I'm told. But let me know in the comments below if you've ever tried their beer. I'd love to hear from you as always. But pretty cool that Trust Beverage Co., like I said, the joint venture between Molson Coors and Hexocorp, Seek me out online, and like I said, they liked the product review, and they sent me this link to sign up for this uh, 
liquid arts kit so all right that's going to do it for today's video folks so thanks for joining us on the pursuit of wolf make sure to smash like subscribe to the channel on your way out and leave a comment below let me know if you've tried the indie pals or the hoss mates which one was your favorite and we'll see you on the next video